Yo, what's going on guys? It's Rest. In this video, I want to go over a brand new armor piece or class now that we got called the Cape of Tides. Now, this thing actually does a lot. And a cool thing it actually does do is it gives your you know character a little cape, which is cool. I'm sure you can do some crazy character customization with that. But what this does is going to have your critical hits have a 25% chance to create a water nova that applies soaked to targets for duration. It increases the duration of all soaked effects by 66%. I'm not sure if there's any more stuff in the game that applies soaked effects other than this. There might be a new legendary that does that. But as of now, I think this is the only thing. And then soaked enemies take 150% damage from lightning and frost, but less damage from fire. So I would imagine like some other class mods, these elements might get thrown around or change elements in general. But I might not though, since soaked is kind of like water and then obviously lightning and frost kind of go well with that. But fire... Uh, I guess won't do as much damage because water put fire out. So this might stay uh, static, but that is what this class one does. And I did get this to drop from Chaos Chamber. I'm pretty sure I actually just got it from my enemy uh, when I was running through the Chaos Chamber. They dropped it for me. And I'm going to go up here and show off you guys what this does. I'll try to show you how this like splash effect works with the splash nova we will be using the liquid cooling as you see we did not get a splash effect right there but we did right there so as you see it kind of covered them both in water and now you do you know reduce damage to fire some bullets are resist and some are just uh just do little damage but it eventually does go away but you do have a 25 percent chance to always proc this water effect and remember when that water effect or soaked effect is on them lightning and frosting are just increased so it pairs really well with something like the liquid cooling even though i know it got nerfed it can kind of bump it up a little bit more like to what it used to be because once you apply that splash effect you were doing more frost damage which is really really good and it's really easy to hit crits with the liquid cooling and you reward it when you hit crits because of that uh reduction to your uh heat on the weapon so Pretty good class mod. I uh, think this actually could have some crazy implications, obviously, with lightning and frost builds, because it's very easy to hit crits and having just 150% more damage to whatever enemy you crit. Uh, it's gonna be really good for some like a stab of answer too. So I can see some crazy, crazy things coming out with this. And again, you do get that really cool cape. But anyway, that's gonna do all for this. If you guys did enjoy and like to see more videos about all the legendary gear, consider subscribing, drop a like, and turn those notifications on. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.